Hey everyone, so I thought that I would do an updated uh, planner setup slash flip through. Um, this is a number three compact Foxy Fix in the color sugar cookie, or in the color cookie in the leather sugar with a rose gold fancy embossed S on the side, or on the front and a beautiful little rose gold paw print on the spine. And so I picked this one because it reminds me of the undercoat of my cat, who I got this year. I got a planner for this year representing him would be really sweet. Um, and so that's why I have the paw print. Um, even though he's a cat, I got the dog print because I thought it was, I don't know, cuter. Um, <clears throat> and so this is the, like I said, sugar cookie in number three compact which means it has four elastics on the inside and it's not as wide as the wide fit um, and it has cream stitching and cream elastics and I do have a number five sugar cookie that came yesterday which has pink stitching and pink elastics which I think is just as pretty but um, for my everyday I really do like this combination. So on the side I'm going to do my best to name where I got everything but if there's anything that I forgot, I will put it in the comments or in the description box below. So this is my pockets. I do have, you, when you order from Foxy Picks, you have the options to get no pockets at all, a secretarial pocket or a secretarial pocket and a card uh, pouch thing on both sides. Or you can do one pocket on one side and not the other so i did opt to get pockets i in all of my foxies i have pockets and um i don't know there's something about it that i like i think one day i might try one without pockets on a larger size but i think for the small size as much storage space as you can have is is really nice so i did um opt to get that and you do get to choose a pen loop if you get pockets so um, in my front pocket, I've just got this paper clip. This is from, I want to say Ladybug on a Pug, but I will double check. Um, I know her shop is on vacation right now, um, and I just got this one customized to look like my cat. This is a drawing paper clip that another shop did for me. I'm going to have to figure out who that was. I forgot the name of the shop, but I will put it in the description box below. Then behind it, I just have this picture of my kitty. Um... His name is Oliver, and he's adorable. Um, this is a freebie that I just laminated from Once More With Love Facebook group. <clears throat> All the dashboards that I have in here are from the Foxy Fix. You can get them from other shops. I just, it's nice to have them um, when you order a new notebook because they're just, they come together and they're there. Um, and also, I do like the sturdiness i think it's either pvc or vinyl and i just i think that they're really nicely made and it's so easy to just switch papers uh in an app so sorry for the glare um this is my first uh dashboard with a august calendar from sparkly paper co i believe um it's a die cut, and that is just on some Planner Society paper, which I think this is one of my favorite Planner Society papers ever. Um, and this is the other side of the paper. Then I have a die cut from the Carpe Diem Planner line uh, from a couple years ago, and I just keep that one there. And then I put one of these $1 spot um, Target adhesive pockets in the front, and I just keep a little magnetic paper clip from Michaels and some stencils from the Planner Society and some Glam Planner uh, Teeny Tuesday stickers. I might just put that somewhere else, but yeah, for now we can put that there. Then I have my, this paper clip I got from my Kate Spade uh, planner buy. Um, this is the 2017 insert from Any Plans Printable, um, and I have this tab from the Planner Society July kit, I believe? No, June kit, um, which I loved and I just didn't take it off. Um, and there's my August layout. It's not very, uh, colorful yet, but I'll get to that. So that's all I have in that first dashboard. 
Um, and then this is also from Sparkly Paper Co. And it just says, don't touch my planner, which I thought was adorable. This is another Planner Society paper in a dashboard from the Fox Effects with a Planner Society tab on the top. This image was a freebie on the, um, there were a couple different shops that were involved in this. I think it was Annie Plans Printables, um, the Fox and Pip, and Sparkly Paper Co. I might be wrong, but I think that's what they were. Um, and my name was in one of the groups. I know there are also ones that say Planner Girl or Planner something, um, but I was fortunate enough to have my name found. Um, so I just printed that out, laminated that, and stuck that in there. Uh, then on the inside of this, I have another one of those Target Dollar Spot pockets with some um, stickers from my shop. We have the Snowball minis and the pipsqueak minis i just moved my planner sizes up so i've got the um, pipsqueak mini coffee girl Ooh, those are stuck together coffee girl some pipsqueak mini date nights some uh, snowball school minis some working pipsqueak some Snowball Falls in Love, some Pipsqueak Movie Dates, some Happy Snowball, and some Snowball is at Work. Um, and those I just keep in my daily uh, folder dollar spot pocket. If I can open that one more, on this is not going to be filmed very well. Um, and this weekly insert is a printable from Annie Plans Printables with the, I think this was a, I'm actually still on the back, was a uh, Simply Watercolor Co. and Annie Plans Printable um, collab. And I just chose this one for August because it's not, I don't have a very busy August, so it's nice to just have a smaller insert and what's nice about these is that they're undated so if you ever have a month where you don't have a lot going on and you don't need the daily insert then this is a good alternative and they come in gray and pink and yeah so this was my last week layout using a uh, kit from or a oops kit from once more with love but they were all wonderful stickers so i don't know why they were oops Michael sticker, a Planner Society sticker, a Glam Plan tune, Teeny Tuesday sticker, a Snowball School sticker, Pipsqueak stickers, Once More With Love, My Shop, uh, Once More With Love, Planner Society. So that's all that's in that one. And this is a Another one of those Target Dollar Spot pockets with a Sparkly Paper Co. die cut. Planner Society, Planner Society, Planner Society die cuts. All this is Planner Society. The August, or sorry, June, July kit. Another one of those things with some Glam Plan. I bought stuff, freebies, and a lucky die cut from Carpe Diem. Um, some online purchases from Annie Plans Printables, and you can just write down store, items purchased, when it was sent, when you got it, and what your thoughts were on it. Um, I then have another dashboard. Or no, that's the same dashboard. Sorry. Then this is another dashboard. This is my sticker uh, on the go pouch thing. Um, I've got a dashboard with a Shakespeare quote and a um, image that I uh, had on a sticker kit in my shop, so I just put it together in that. So a koala gem sticker from a hardware store in my area. Then Foxy Fix has these adhesive secretarial pockets that you can get so I just got that and added it to the dashboard and have some stickers in there I have this PVC 
pocket thing from eBay. Um, all you have to do is search like PVC Midori or Traveler's Notebook Pocket in a six size because that's if you want this um, this size. Uh, so I just have some Glam Planner te uh, Teeny Tuesday stickers and a the freebies that come with it up there. Some Planner Society stickers down here and some freebies from all different shops. Then it also has this zipper pouch. And I've got the rest of those Sparkly Paper Co. monthly views, which I just put in the front. And some extra stickers, some band-aids, and a uh, Sparkly Paper Co. bee die cut. I've got some stickers from my shop cut up, um, some Once More With Love, and some picture sheets. Then I have this acetate from the Planner Society. On the back of this dashboard I have two pictures of my other cat whiskers and me and my boyfriend um, in San Francisco. And then this clip is from Burns & Noble um, a really long time ago. And then this is just the password Annie Plans printable thing. So I'm not going to open that but you can just write your username and passwords for various websites. And I have another dashboard um, with a die cut from the Planner Society and acetate inside from the Planner Society. Or no, vellum. Yeah, this is acetate. This is vellum. That's what it is. Um, my meal planner from Annie Plans. A P Aaron Condor pen loop with a midliner uh, highlighter, which I really like because they're dual ended, which I think is really cool. Um, so you have a skinny side and then a little bit of a thicker side. Then this is another dashboard that just says notes. All this is from the Planner Society uh, June kit, I believe. May kit? I'm not sure. I think it's May kit. Um, Planner Society vellum, which I love this vellum. I've kept it in there for a long time. And then this notebook was from the Glam Planner mystery kit a couple months ago. I'm going to just use this as a literal brain dump for everything. This clip was from uh, Burns Noble, I think. Yeah, and then on the back I just have another ladybug on a pug um, unicorn paperclip and a Planner Society um, laminated sticking out. I was going to turn into a magnetic clip, but I haven't gotten around to getting the magnets put in this. I saw this idea in a Facebook group uh, somewhere, um, and I thought it was adorable, but I just haven't gotten around to doing that. So that is everything in my number three traveler's notebook. Um, I will, like I said, link everything or leave names or everything below. Um, so thanks for watching and let me know if you have any questions.